I cannot see anything right now. Oh my god! Hello, Xavier here. Welcome back to another episode of the Modern Minecraft Survival Series. And today we are back again. I have leveled up quite a lot, guys. As you can see, I have. Whoa, whoa, okay. There we go. I have. And I'm in level 24. I have 37 on the top. I spent at least two hours on the grinder, and I think a zombie's here for revenge. Anyway, so, uh, let's talk about what happened while. Okay, let me go down there real quickly. Um, I have no food. I should probably bring food just in case. Alright, so. Uh, da -da -da, let's bring. Oh, yeah, so I got some potatoes. I'm gonna get some meat. Get that out of the way. Actually, I have a lot of berries, so I'll eat those. Okay, so let's go. <laughs> Alright guys, so, like I said, I spent hours grinding over here, and I, I, have a, I have a lot of stuff here that I can show you guys. A lot of armor, a lot of noise, and I found these really cool stuff, so, um, look at that, okay. Uh, flame and lightweight, uh, it shows the throwback range of this weapon, so it's like cool things. Now, as you can see, this is what we're going to be doing today, but let me show you guys all the drops that I found. I found these zombie upgrade stones to use this with any item with level in an anvil. I don't know what these do, I'll probably research it later. There's so much noise, I have a lot of rotten flesh. I have cookies and carrots, I'm gonna take the carrots because I can plant those. I'll take these as well. But anyways, um, let me tell you guys about my experience with the uh, mob farm. The XP farm is fantastic. I got a lot of cool loot from it and it worked out really fine. Because uh, if you guys remember, I had a looting one sword. I actually combined that with a sword that I got, which was the Difficulties Endowment 1. And I combined it. And I also had a Sharpness 2 sword, and I combined that with it as well. So, here's my level 32 Iron Sword. Really cool. This is an amulet which greatly reduces the change of negative effects when using undiscovered spells. Huh. Cool. Anyways, let's, let's, if we can go in, <laughs> uh, let me show you guys what I've done so far. So, in my sprints, level 2, athletics, nothing yet. My crafting, I did put some cooking, some green thumb, and some fishing proficiency, as well as harvest, smelting, uh, nothing brewing yet. Combat-wise, I put that to 4, melee damage. My iron skin is 4, and my shield is still 1. And my stealth is 4. So the cool thing is, if I sneak, uh, mobs have a lower chance of noticing me. And if I sneak and attack, I increase the attack damage output. Uh, so as you can see, I have 4 times the amount of health that I had last time. Well, no, I think I had like 2 times, because I think last time I hit 2. It's turning night time. But the goal of today is to explore. So we're gonna make one of these, but I need some iron and some redstone. Thankfully, I have both of those. I'm gonna get those. I, I didn't go mining at all, so nothing's new about that. So I'm gonna make one of those. And unfortunately, I am going to be making, well, using the only sugar canes that I have. Hopefully, when I go exploring, I can find some more, um, because I have no more. And it's time to go to sleep. Okay, so let's make this uh this thing. So let's make it paper first, okay? Make some paper, make a book, and then oh no no I'm gonna make the empty atlas. Now this is the map. Uh, I could have had a map on the top right screen, but there's so many stuff on the screen I didn't want to bother that. So I decided to go with this one. This one's a really fun way of uh, mapping out the world. So here we are. Wow. Our world. Uh, let's go put a marker in there. So this is our... 
home right here. So let's put a marker. Um, add a marker right there, right? And uh, let's see, where should I put? Put that one. There you go. And this is a. Uh, uh, I don't know what to call this. Let's call this. Um, <laughs> forest base there you go forest base and done so this is our forest base really cool you can zoom out by a lot so that's what we're going to be doing today we're going to be exploring so question is should we go up north south west east i said that the wrong way but hey it doesn't matter cool thing is we get to explore i think i'll go east uh, let's go east and we'll explore the world that way the cool thing is if i press v it tells me where I'm facing. So this is south. See? Uh, and then this way is west. So I'm going this way to east. So let's go that way. And then we'll, uh, I'll just update you guys on whether I find anything interesting. They have been upgrading the stuff here. So just upgrade the stone. Hello, my friend. The building I see. Alright, well, let us move on with our exploration and let's explore this wonderful world of ours. I found this over here. I'm curious about this right here. I wonder what that is right there. I'm trying to see what that is, but I found this, which is really cool. I'm going to get the seeds because why not? With a pond. And we're going to head to see. It's like wild. It's a wild boar, though. A Look, it's a hen. Okay, so we're near that. Oh no, it's. A, I think that was a hill. Oh, okay. I know where we are. Okay. So this is the underground tower that we went to the first time. I think I marked this part. No. Nah. Actually, yeah. I'd mark it. I'm gonna mark it. Let me just stand right next to it. Put a marker right there and we're gonna call this underground battle tower there you go guys I found the village Whoa, 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 look, guys, 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 look, we can talk this out, we can talk this out, we can talk this out. Oh my god, look, I, I was not doing anything wrong, guys, I was just coming over here. I, I found the village that are trying to kill me now. Did I bring, did I eat, I didn't even bring bows, are you kidding me? Oh, they came back home. Hey, you. Back off. Back off. There we go. I'm going to kill you. Okay. Look at that. They got Maya carving. And mice. I don't know what that is. Looks like I'll be staying here in this little abode in this, this area. In the area. I think that's money for them. Well, at least I have a place I can stay, but uh, no bed. So I'm gonna. I'll get back to you guys whenever. Uh. <laughs> Whenever daytime comes. Alright guys, it is day now. And as you can see, I was kind of busy. Um, I didn't want to die. So, I'm in a little border here. And then, I got attacked by two skeletons and one werewolf. So, uh, yeah, we're fine. Uh, I actually did pretty good. Uh, I didn't record it because, I mean, I didn't want to spend 20 minutes recording. I'm just showing you guys. I'm surviving. I got an iron sword from the skeleton. 
you already know how where I get that. Uh, two pumpkins, which is really cool. I'll put that there, and as well, I got some birch wood because I, I again I don't know why. Oh, I got four, five ingots. When did I get that? Uh, and again, I I don't, I don't need that. I got some bows from the things from the skeletons. Uh, silkworm, I don't need that. Uh, I'll leave that there. I'll take that. Take leave that. I'll take this just in case, and uh, I think we are ready to go. I don't know what this is, so I'll just leave that there for now. And I still need a backpack. So, uh, backpack. Where's my backpack? I need one wool. Oh, I think I can make it. I just need wool. I don't have any string. Oh, man. If I can get lucky and find... Oh, look. Winter is, like, really bad in this area. But anyways... Let me show you the map, because I, I did a little thing here, so. Uh, wow. Wow, it is really starting to pour here. Alright, so. I'm going to delete marker. I'm going to delete that one. I'm going to add a new marker, and I'm going to put it right there. And I'm going to put make this the, uh, use that, and I'm going to call it the uh, outpost. Right now, yeah, I'll call it an outpost. There you go. So that's the outpost. We're gonna continue going this way while it snows. So there we go. Wow, the visibility has gone down by a lot. Ah, oh, come on. Four creepers shouldn't harm me unless there was other creepers around, so. Okay. Wow. That took down so much health. God dang it. Okay, I need some mending for that. I'm hoping I can get some mending or at least some advanced mending on that. Oh, a new biome! That's so cool. What kind of biome is this? Majestic, what is that? A peahen. Oh, come on! Not the blood moon. It's so dark, I cannot see anything right now. Oh my god! It's a slime girl. Okay guys, I finally got my stuff back. I am in a completely different area because I got my stuff way over there. Actually, let me show you. Let's kill these things first.
Okay, now I can explain things. Alright, so this is where I first died. Right? Then I died over here. And here I am now. So I found this house where I could hide. Oh, please don't. Okay. Uh, and the guy was sleeping. I went inside, and a bunch of traveling villagers started coming inside. And it was still blood moon, so a bunch of zombies just stormed inside, it killed everything, including me. I managed to jump onto the roof, and I died right here. <laughs> so here we are, guys. We find a new biome. Two. The little pink swamp. Well, there's a swamp. It's a pink one. And then this place. So I am going to actually claim this spot as my own right here. Whoa! Really? What? Want of negation? What does that do? Can't spell. Wand of Negation. I have no idea what that does, but I found something cool. Anyways, I'll, I'm going to mark this house <laughs> in the map. But first let me take these things down. And then I'm going to mark this one, but I need to... Uh, I'm going to put it right there. I'm going to call this the... Uh, Barn house outpost. <laughs> Another outpost I have found, guys. And this one does have a bed. Guys, look. I found sheep. I cannot. And the regular sheep, too. Can, can I kill the. I'm sorry, the lag is really killing me. Can I kill one of you guys? Can I get any. I didn't get any wool. Oh, uh, well, okay, well, I'm killing this one. Uh, do I really want to kill that one? It's not, I don't, I don't guarantee to get wool. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's the wool. Alright, guys, so. I, I, oh, oh, block, block, let's, uh, is there any flowers? Yes, I found the block bin. And I gave it to you. Hello, Mr. Blockman. <gasps> no, give me back my sword. Yeah, give me back my sword. It's my sword. No, follow me. Okay, stats not very good. Uh, hunt, mine, chop, farm, idle, ignore. Whoa! What's that? I'm over here. There you go. Oh, nice. I got a Blocklin. Ooh, I can get another one. Hello, Mr. Blocklin. How would you like to be my friend? I have two of them, yes. Yeah, I got two buddies. I'll let you guys through the front door. Come on. There you go. Come inside. Inside the new abode. There we go. Come on. You too, big guy. I think this is going to be my outpost for now, guys. Come on. Come on. There we go. Come on. In you go. No. Okay. I'm going to take that down though. They don't need that anymore. Come on. Oh my god. Come 
Come on. There you go. You can stay. No! I finally got both of you inside. Come on. This snow is very annoying. Come on. There you go. Stay. Good lord. I never thought it would be hard to take care of blocks. Okay, so uh, it looks like this will be my uh, temporary outpost right here. I have a nice... Uh, I, I want to say... <gasps> Evil beings must be perished. What are you, level... Oh, where's my... There you go. Oh, come on. That's cool. I have an infinite source of spawning. Whoa, what the flip? Hey, leave the man alone. Come closer, I dare you. Okay. Hello, my good sir. We shall be living together now. These are my blocklands, and you shall appreciate their existence. <laughs> okay, nice. So I have a new area that I can explore. And there's so many blocklands. Yes. I see great things coming our way. Alright guys, so off screen, I'm going to be leveling up the block lens. Leveling, leveling up myself, so I'll probably go back home over there. Because I do have the map, it's going to be a while though. And this is going to be a post right here. And I could possibly start making a house here. We never know. Uh, I'm too close to the swamp to my liking because of those sirens. They're going to be so annoying to fight. But I think we're going to soon find our permanent house. You know, that will be really great. And then I'll just make a giant tunnel all the way over there. So I won't have to go through all that again. And hopefully no more blood moons anytime soon. Because my man, Issa sends a... J Gero, I'll call him Ger Gero. Yeah, I just call him Isaiah. <laughs> my my friend Isaiah here, we're roommates now. So, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button, and hit that notification bell to get notified whenever I upload any new videos. And we'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.